we are not seeing anything good to celebrate. I can say that because I am a graduate and I don't even have a job now, I'm still looking for. So there is nothing to celebrate in this country. Hello, my name is Sinafi Omanga, and this is the Independence Edition of Eyes on the Street. Happy Independence to all Nigerians from all of us at the International Center for Investigative Reporting. This is the first independence under President Bola Tinubu. It's indeed special. But let's hear the streets and hear from Nigerians how they feel about this independence. Things are going on well, like Nigeria being 63 uh, is, uh, is a progress, it's, it's not a rocket science. America are almost 100 years and they still have their loopholes, regardless of Nigeria having a whole lot of difficulties in leadership. We still believe in Nigeria that one day Nigeria will get there. It's a process. We are just 63. There are those who are 150, there are those who are 200, they are still having their own leadership crisis. All we pray for is for our leaders to do the right thing so that we can have the Nigeria of our dream. So we hope in Nigeria, we will be still hope in Nigeria, even as a Nigerian youth. I desire that we can actually get it right in this country. If we can, all of us, if we can all join hands together and do the right things, it means that Nigeria can be a better place. Like right now, individuals are already feeling like, you know, we're having a problem with people in the legislative or people in authority. Well, yes, to some extent, all right? But then um, every other person has a part to play in making Nigeria a better place. But more importantly, Nigeria as a nation, I think we're having serious problem with the people in power. We're having very serious problem with the process that gets people into power. It's a faulty process. Well, um, it's a homecoming and uh, uh, no, definitely, uh, Nigerians are waiting for this day to come and uh, by the special grace of God Almighty uh, we are going to celebrate and uh, it's, it's worth celebrating because we've now have a new government and uh, we have uh, cause to thank God for sparing our, our life more importantly to see Independence Day, Nigerians as a city, well, is what um, is what to be celebrated. And I know as the uh, event unfold, the generation unborn will witness uh, Independence Days in years to come. And we are happy for this day that has come. I'm very happy. It's a good development. It shows that we are growing as a country. So I'm happy that Nigeria is 63, uh, 63 years. Uh, we're happy and we pray God should give us good leadership and the government should provide more for its citizens. Uh, Nigeria as a name is celebrating uh, uh, her 30, uh, 63 years of independence. But compare to other countries. Uh, we can say that our achievement is not achievable. Our objectives is not achievable because we do not achieve our objectives. One, we are in insecurity, especially in northern part of the country. Secondly, there is hardship of living by Nigerians. And thirdly, there is lack of employment in Nigeria. And if you look at it, in a country where there is insecurity, we, what are we going to celebrate? Are we going to celebrate the issue of insecurity in our country or what? Or the issue of uh, lack of employment by youths? The hardship we are in. If you look at it, now things are getting harder and is getting worse than before. So what is the, what the message now I am sending to Nigerians is that one, we should look for a way out to our problems because no problems is not uh, cannot be solved any problem that you see there must be a solution to it so our government they should look for a way out for nigerians because if you look at it not even the people within the metro metropolitan living inside the metropolitan go outside and see how are they living 
what are they getting from the government? The government, our government promised us that uh, uh, the masses will, will laugh, but the masses are crying. So why is it so in our country? At this time, we are in now. Nigeria celebrating 63 years without any development. I don't see anything there. I don't see anything there. Because if it's a country that is um, improving, if it's a country that is um, helping the youth to grow, according to the renewal hope we had from this um, administration, it should have been a help for everyone. Everyone should have been happy by now. We are praying for the better of Nigeria and we pray all what we are going through will pass through and uh, I believe in this government and they will deliver, inshallah. Despite the challenges we face as a nation, this is the only country we can call our own. Nigerians are calling on the government of President Bola Tinibu to deliver on the promises of renewed hope. My name is Sinafi Omanga. See you again next week for another interesting edition of Eyes in the Streets. Bye for now.